Alright guys, yeah, since I woke up at a goofy ass time, um, me, and I guess now my cat, because she wants to say hello, say hello Maisie, come on, say hello, tell people hi, well what do you gotta say Maisie, alright, yeah, well anyway, she says hello, um, I'm gonna basically show off my extensive collection of all item label stuff, and I mean like everything. The whole nine yards, because you're not gonna believe it, but my goofy ass self decided to actually, uh, you know, collect even more than what I already had. And you guys probably saw the last last video, and the last one already was like me showing off like a, a collection, so you're probably wondering like, bro, do I have a problem? at this point and I guess you could say that but to me it's more of a I just have a knack for collecting rare and obscure items so call it what you want I don't really see it as a bad thing I see it as a win but anyway I'm gonna go and show you the extension of my insanity I guess is what we're gonna call this of course my cat's already starting to mess with stuff <laughs> but anyways you know let's get into it I guess as you can see here, uh, this is the first half of the collection that I want to show off because I'm trying to do it in categories. But as you can see, I've got the classic pattern, cow pattern, peepee -pee, that we all know and love. You know, the one that started it all, that like popped up into the DMs out of nowhere overnight to convince us to join him and his crazy antics. Um, then I acquired the pink pee. Which, you know, this one you guys probably didn't know about because I didn't really do an unboxing. I didn't really show off the fact that I got that one. <laughs> but then next to that, we've got Freezer Burn P. One of the OG ones, some of the, one of the earlier ones I, that I had gotten alongside, you know, this one. Because he was the first one I got. You guys knew about the Axolotl P because of the Mains vs. Mobs video. Because, you know, he was a part of that. So I got that one. Uh, due to accidentalness, even though I don't regret it, I have two of the Tough Luck PPs, and honestly, I really like his color scheme, because blue and purple are my top two favorite colors, and so is green, and I really like the sleekness, the softness, I love that he smiles here despite his shortcomings, because he's able to still have, you know, a happy day despite missing certain body parts. I acquired the hard elusive you know corn pea one of the ones i really really wanted i like the mustard and ca ketchup squiggle lines on his back his body shape and his goofy face here i got shroom pea as well which this is another one i do not think i showed in a video at all i don't think i don't remember doing that but yeah here is him and his glory you know i have tiger pea you know with his cute whiskers and fluff Minecraft boy, aka, you know, Q uh, I have him. <laughs> I acquired the brand new Skunk Bee, and I love his color scheme. I, I do. And it's kind of interesting because his tail is done a bit different than, like, the rest of them. And it's real fluffy and soft and stuff. And, of course, you guys know about Angel Pea that I got right here that comes with the epic Angel Pea sword. Pretty epic. I like their wings, their halo, their cute little smiley face because it's the little cat smiley face, you know. The the mega peepee -pee that I got at Christmas. Um, and of course, Devil Pee. So, and his epic sword. So, my question is, is are you a Angel Pee or Devil Pee fan? Do you prefer Devil Pee? Or Angel P, because if comments don't get turned off, I want to know: Are you like Angel P that drinks water on regular basis? Or are you like Devil P, where you're like, huh, I'm gonna have sugar, soda, energy drinks, and coffee instead, at like hours that you typically wouldn't? You know, like I I'm curious. You know, let me know. You know, in the comments, if it doesn't get turned off, but I have a bad feeling they might try to for some dumb reason. But anyways, I also acquired at least one clamp P. Because I like the concept. It's a very interesting concept, if I'm going to be honest. Very, very unique. Then, as you see back here, 
I got this Dinkle that my brother got me at Christmas time, which is something I got around the same time I got the Mega PP over here. But I also recently got the Forsaken Dinkle, which I think is a really, you know, good addition to the team here. Because, like, he's got that cool little heart locket, the Band-Aid and stuff. My brother said that he, he really liked the, the little Band-Aid on his face right here. I actually just really like his entire design in general. Like, it's pretty unique. And at one point, I got at least... I'll have to get the other Wee Wees off here. But I was able to acquire for a limited, a limited time only. Because you only had a short window of time to get these. Because I think it... I want to say it was ser Series Y. Because they restocked Series Y Wee Wees during a short time frame in the month of May. May. And I was able to at least get four of them. I don't think they have, like, actual name names. So you can pretty much nickname them whatever the heck you want. Because there's no known information on them. They're just kind of, like, really weird versions of the Wee Wee's. And so I got the three-eyed one right here. I got this one that's got, like, I want to say, like, a leopard pattern. He's pretty cool. Then I got the one that's, like, half the entire body is basically just egg. And then his feet kind of popping out. And then what I would like to consider the mascot of this series, the Alarm Clock Wii. Which I actually think that's pretty cool. <laughs> it's pretty dang cool, I'm, I'm not going to lie. Now, we're, get, we're going to move on to the other Wii Wiis. Like, you know, the series, I think, 2 and 3. Because I think this uh, and 4. Because I kind of just mix-matched them all together. You know, because I was trying to be quick with this, you know. But we have one cube Wii, which is kind of like, you know, the baby version of, like, you know, the cube, QP. I actually have three of these guys of the Caramel Apple. So here is his little sibling buddies. There's three of them. I have one of the What Wiis, which was one of the few Wii Wiis I was hoping to get. I actually have two of the Tough Luck Wiis. So now, you know, they can be looked after by the Tough Luck PP. I have an inverted Wii. Y'all know about Strawberry. Because, you know, that one. The two two of the Bee Wees that I have right here. Two Bee Wee. Um, and the two Tomatoes. And Purple Fuzz. You guys know about that. But I also have the Plaid Wii, which is made a bit differently. He's got, like, this material is kind of roughish but it's definitely not fur material but i do like that they changed the material up sent it to plaid wee instead of like one that's got like the softness or the fluffiness like purple was so we've got all that going on now we can now move on to the mun muns i actually have uh this new mun mun i can't exactly remember the name of him right now i had the packaging so, I would have been able to tell you what it was, but I can't remember. But I did get the rare picnic one, which was pretty cool. Because I like the Mun Muns. A lot of mine were technically just w w good luck because, you know, they were freebies, technically. I got, like, this one right here. I've got, like, two of the party Mun Muns here, which he was one I wanted as well. And then two Glee Mun Muns. Then... I have the item label fish card water drinking cup right here. Uh, again, I'll show off my hat. You know, the version 2, you know, genius hat with the uh, the little patches right here. You know, PP, corn P, Q, P, and shroom P. My happy PP, you know, item label t-shirt right here. The daggum item label, you know, mushroom hoodie. And then all of my vinyl figures. Every single vinyl figure that you see here. Four Uranium P, two Great PP, Spice P, and P 